So we're in the town of Jefferson, Texas, which gets my vote for the prettiest small town in the entire state. This is an example of what you'll see in this lovely town. This is House of the Seasons, built in the year 1872. It's my understanding that this house serves as a bed and breakfast. You can also do tours by reservation. But what a gorgeous house. If you like historic hotels, I highly recommend to stay in the Excelsior House here in Jefferson. This is actually the oldest continuously operating hotel in the state of Texas, beginning in the year 1858. We stayed here last year and had a great experience. So keep in mind this is a historic hotel, so it's not going to be like a modern spacious hotel, but it is beautiful inside with lots of nice uh, antique furniture and, and things and just across the street is a very interesting historic site this is Jay Gould's railroad car so legend has it that Jay Gould wanted to build a railroad through the town of Jefferson they voted it down because they were already a major Riverport town at that time and didn't think they needed it he was angry swore revenge kind of made some threats and left town in a huff. A few years later, the natural dam that existed downstream uh, was blown up. And so this dropped the river levels uh, through Jefferson and, and it was no longer a viable port town after that. The town shrunk by more than half and uh, because the economy was devastated. And many blame Gould for possibly having a hand in that and so that's that's the legend one of the cool things to see while you're here it's on Austin Street is this Jefferson General Store and you always see that beautiful old blue truck in front of it really cute store on the inside if you want some souvenirs and whatnot I recommend going inside places to grab lunch if you're in Jefferson is this restaurant right here on the corner just know that it can get crowded on weekends it's well worth a visit if you can get a table if you like antique stores the town of Jefferson has definitely got you covered several stores uh, dot this main part of town here and this is one of the more photogenic ones here right across the railroad tracks it's a beautiful old building. Quick, I just wanted to thank the city of Jefferson for putting in these beautiful, easily accessible public restrooms here. So, uh, very convenient if you're walking around town.
For those of you that like walking down nature trails, there's a lovely little hike right at the edge of the main part of town here in Jefferson that takes you kind of along the bayou. And uh, much of the trail is on this elevated sort of bridge. And it's definitely worth it if you just want like a quick little 15 minute walk through nature. interesting little museum here in town uh, on the front it says Mason Dixon line uh, it has a lot of World War II memorabilia and other things well worth the visit it packs a lot into a fairly small space places you should really visit if you come to Jefferson is this museum right here. It's called the Museum of Measurement and Time. This guy has an incredible collection of old clocks, uh, old record players, old antiques. Really, really cool museum. Can't recommend it enough. It's well worth your time. One of the unique things that you can see here in town is this Gone with the Wind Museum. It's full of memorabilia from the movie and perhaps the book as well. And right next to it is this gorgeous house. Oh my goodness, look at that. Absolutely stunning. <laughs> 